Oh, you guys want to know how I got a pick here? You guys want to know inside information how I got a pick? Because this stupid game is why I got a pick, all right? Listen, this is passion. We got the playoffs, boys. CFM playoffs. We are in the divisional round. We have to play VA Dimes, who has joined the Tampa Bay Buccaneers. Those of you guys that have been following CFM all year, let me know in the chat. Let me know in the comments. I've been following CFM all year. This is our last run. I know VA Dimes is a super off meta person. And you guys know, like I said, all you guys have been following is the Tampa Bay Buccaneers are one of the best teams in the league. Let's take a look at them now so we can show you guys. So this team has been kind of cerebral victory. Had them, John Beast had them. Like they've kind of been different owners for the last couple of years. At the end of the year, people don't want to play as much. So it's found different owners for them, but they are one of the better teams in the league. Marcus Mariota is mobile. Uh, Marquez Valdez Scantling. We have D Danny Gray, really fast wide receivers. Lazard, just big body receivers that are fast. This is a good team right here. Robert Tunyon and the defensive side of the ball, Stingley, Westry, absolute dogs. And then he'll have Ramsey at safety, which is a little different. Maybe he puts him in linebacker, maybe he keeps him in safety. Buda Baker, Jonathan. I mean, honestly, just absolute dogs. Absolutely dogs on this team. This team has definitely been passed around, but it's, I don't think, it, I'm gonna say it's the best, but it, it's definitely uh, up there for sure. So uh, we're gonna have our hands full, and I know VA Dimes is a off meta player. I really don't know. It used to be a lot of like quarterback runs or like read option type, right? Goosa, stuff like that. Wide receiver, jet screen passes, touch all, stuff like that. So I'm going to have to, you know, play on the fly. I have no scouting report, no nothing. And one thing people say, uh, and this is one thing that blows my mind when people talk about the meta. Oh, you just run tight. It's playing against the meta is so predictable defensively and offensively. Like, I think, like, it's it's one of the biggest complaints. Once I hear somebody complaining about that, I just dismiss their Madden knowledge and their Madden passion because, dude, when I go into a game and I know what you're going to run, I feel like my job is so much easier on defense and offense. Honestly, you know, and Dimes has been really good for a long time now. He has. Well, I don't think we played this year, but we have played like he's an old head like me, you know. All right, so like I said, man, we gotta we gotta think on the fly here, boys. One of my strengths, strength, one of my strength as a man player is always preparing. Not much to prepare on here, boys. So I gotta show off another strength is adjusting on the fly and figuring out what to do. It's not him. It's not. I guess it's the game. I guess there's literally a drone. He's already set 15 audibles. You know, so we're gonna get an audible fest and it's gonna be nasty, so. And. Pick six, let's go, man. Toe, adjust on the fly, baby. Come oh, on. Now between me and you guys, no, I'm gonna be honest. I didn't mean to do that shit. I think I fat fingered it. But it was a great adjustment. You know, somebody with fraud, you know, I don't know how he did that. I don't know. I, I, don't, I really don't know. But he made a play. And I fronted like I did something. But, you know, let's go. Dude, how is my D tackle getting cut blocked by the center? Come on with this dumb shit. I don't, I don't. Honest. Oh, Fumble! You bitch! I hit hard! Like, what did they think he was doing right there? Like, what did they think? Like, what what, what was that? Like, what? Shout out to Garrett Wilson. Made me pick this guy battle. Didn't know who it was. I'll be honest. Garrett Wilson said pick him. And look at him. He makes the pick in the last game. Forces a fumble right there. Of course, our boy's not even in the game. Are we running match early? Oh, yeah, we lost. I'm be honest, when people run match and it's confusing, which is confusing to me, it's confusing to whoever runs it. They don't know what's gonna hell, hell's gonna happen. If you learn one something for this game, literally you put four wide receivers on one side of the quarterback and they can't match anymore. Literally all you gotta do, boys. I have four options on one side of the, and then that's it. That's all we gotta do, you know? Come on, man, I'm way more physical than this guy. Get the f off my field, dude. 
Get this rinky dink bubblegum ass bullshit off my field, dude. Like, how do I stop RPOs like that? Like, what do I do? I got a pass commit? Like, how do I, like, stop, like, RPOs, though? Like, I don't know, like... I don't want to pass commit, but, like... This is so f made offense, dude. This is what scrubs do. Short knockout. It's not happening, kid. Just gotta stop the run here. Like, like I don't know, like you know what I'm saying? Like, ah, come on, man! It's bumped, man. I put two people dog. Dog, this sh stupid. That literally two f people on this guy, dude. The whole team is on him. All right, it's just dumb, as f bro. Hey, people say oh, RPOs in the game, but like, why are my people not guarding that guy? That's what pisses me off. Cause when you pass commit, now your now your D line forgets how to play. You know what I'm saying? Like you'll get pancaked. So I sh if I pass commit, I shouldn't get pancaked on. Good sh boys, way to be there. Game, let me dive, man. That's my fault, man. Like, why would you give me that stupid animation? To, like, you know what I'm saying? Like, let me dive in the end zone. It happens to be so much. Does that happen to you guys? Maybe I shouldn't be a be a and dive in the end zone. Maybe it's teaching me to not showboat. Maybe it's teaching me not to showboat. I wanted to dive in the end zone. I did. You know? Did I dive too soon? Did I dive too early? Was it too late of a dive? Like, what's my move there, boys? Come here, bitch. I mean, dog, who, what type of blocking do you get? Like, just miracle. Oh, my God. It's Come on. Come here. Thank you, man. Fumble, out of bounds. God, I suck. Bag. Bag. Nothing. Absolutely nothing. Absolutely nothing! On my field, man! Alright, one more score, field goal, touchdown, whatever. We win this game. Just gotta keep playing offense. We've had the ball twice, we've got two touchdowns. I mean, that's, that's gonna win us the Super Bowl offense. I'm unconservative, we're holding the ball. I did change the meta of CFM. Took these idiots all year, been running deep knockouts. It's like Mixon should run him over, bro. That uh, I don't really like running here on, uh, what should we call it? On nickel normal, I really don't, but. How does nobody get to the middle linebacker right there, dude? Move. I don't like him lurking that side because that's the side I want to high low over there. Like I want to high low that side of the field. Just made a play. 
I mean, I wouldn't switch it against the stop the run out of Nickel Normal, bro. But really, like, Nickel Normal should stop the run. Come on, man. I guess that was Randy Moss trying to block that. I mean, honestly, boys, this is where I'll tell you, this 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 might be the difference between me and the, the other SCFM little kids. But this game, this game should 100% be over at this point. Man, that's not what I should have did. I sh God, I thought I'd be able to throw that drag, and I just, I, that was a dumb throw away. I dropped back too far to where I couldn't get sacked anymore. I don't know, maybe I could have got sacked and still made that field goal, but that was just a mental mistake, dude. I stared down the drag, and I didn't like throwing it. It wasn't worth the risk. It was just stupid, dude. I wanted to make it the fourth quarter right there. I really did. That was my goal. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But I wanted to give myself a chance to get the first down. But I really didn't have my heart in throwing anything risking, really. You want to keep this guy in bounds right there. That's out of bounds? Get the f out of here, man. Oh. He passed that up so crazy. If you want to run the ball, just run the ball. You can run the ball. Pick! I mean, I should have clicked on that one, though. I don't know what I'm doing. I'm so old! <laughs> like, what are we doing? Like, this is so bad, those passes. Like, what the hell? I didn't think he was throwing that. I thought he would throw the post. He threw a post backside on the... And I guarded the angle route. The post was wide open, though. I really didn't expect him to throw that, dude. Like, if I expect the pass, I'm ready to click on. But, like, he just chucked his coverage. Like, what are we doing? Like, well, I'm sorry, boys. Like... I mean, the blocking there, boys. It's just no way, dude. Like, dude, come in. Man, God, like I played conservative with such a lead and then I just had two bonehead ass plays. I'm so pissed off at myself. Dude. The game is literally walking off the field by now. We really are completely walking off the field. But because I, because I throw the ball away on two plays, fourth down and then that one, third down, we have a wide open streak and somehow the dude knocks it out from got Siberia. The dude is beat by 10 yards and knocks it out from Siberia on a game. Like, dude, like, God, I'm just like, just stupid mental shit has made this game. I have to get a first down now. Stupid, absolutely mental shit. I don't even need a first. I just need to not be an idiot, dude. Y'all ain't see that coming, did y'all? Y'all ain't see that coming, did y'all? Daddy! I mean, he's the one that got outsticked in the air. He the one that got outsticked in the air, not me. I mean, I wanted to throw the other streak that was wide open, and I low-key hit the wrong button. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. What do you want me to tell you? But at the end of the day, the ball was in the air, and who took it? I didn't have a 6'8 wide receiver. That was a little 5'11 wide receiver. GG's, oh, GG's. I tried to sell.
The juice, the juice, the juice, the juice. No, he just got moss. Like, he just got a tea bag. If he didn't click on, it's, it's, it's knocked out with 100%. I always motion over the outside guy who's B when I do this. I don't know why I motion. So I honestly wanted to just throw B. But, you know, streak was wide open. I just wanted to throw the ball to B right here. Which normally, every time I motion over is the outside wide receiver. I don't know why. Because mo- what I did was I motioned over Firemuth because he's a better blocker. And I thought he would think I was running and maybe run commit. So that's why I motioned over Firemuth, which was I-, I always go motion over B. So it's always B and then A is the f***ing drag. That's what happened. Oh, you guys want to know how I got a pick here? You guys want to know inside information how I got a pick? Because this stupid f- game is why i gotta pick all right because this c- sucking crap listen this is passion all he wants to do is audible around all about motion put your people this way motion glitch find rpo scumbag sh- right and madden gets confused by it so what happens is normally your outside corner is quick adjustment is b every time this guy is b every single time but when they audible this guy now becomes lb so what i wanted to do was man up a safety that's normally LB on the running back. So I did quick adjustment LB running back, but I got lucky that because the game's so broken, it makes my outside corner LB that I actually manned up the outside corner on the running back by accident. Pick six. I mean, he played himself. 